Can cheesecake stay good in the freezer for over a year? Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. Coming in cold with some boop -boop 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 freezer research. Yep, freezer research. Now, according um. to the USDA or the USTA, as we say in the McLaughlin household, if a food is kept frozen at zero degrees Fahrenheit, then it is safe to eat indefinitely. 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 Doesn't sound very definitive. And just because it's safe, that doesn't mean it's gonna actually taste good. After a certain amount of time, frozen food that then prepare, then's prepared, then's prepared, loses some of its tastiness, right? I don't know, that's what we're gonna find out. All right, well, in the name of science, we're gonna find, we're gonna try some foods, they've already been found. Yeah. Uh, and they've been frozen for various lengths of time, and we're gonna see if they're still up to par. Mm -hmm. It's time for, how bad can food taste that's been in the freezer for a year? It's not like we're eating Walt Disney's cryogenically frozen a year. As you can see, we can't. Okay, boys, in front of you are three versions of the same food, one frozen a year ago, one frozen a month ago, and one that's fresh. And each round, you will place your hand over the one-year frozen item, so the oldest item, and the points will escalate as we move forward. The winner will be crowned the frozen one. And shout out to our Mythical crew members for never cleaning out their freezers so we could try some old as heck food today. Yeah, our for first real. item is filet mignon. Oh, yeah. And the one-year-old filet was brought to you by Selene. Oh, Selene? <laughs> Selene, why are you sitting on a, a filet for a year? Treat yourself. <laughs> I like a good filet. Who knows, maybe it gets better over time. Maybe it like a, breaks down. I got a big old piece from my number one. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just put that. I like just eating meat with my hands. Oh gosh. What is he doing? Uh, I mean, he's doing something. Is linkish, this a right? bite? You? No, no. no just, you're back. You're, you're grabbing like the large piece that's not a bite every time. I was wondering why the bites are so big. Yeah. I'm grabbing the whole steak. Hold on. Yeah. You grabbed the whole steak with the first one. Yeah, for both of them. And I'm kind of hoarding it over here. <laughs> Okay, there's a very distinct difference between the number one steak and the number two steak, but I'm not gonna say what the distinct difference is. One of them tastes a lot better. Mm -hmm. One of them tastes nastier um, than the other one, which on, tastes better. Is this just a piece of steak that Link has on? Yes, yeah, do not don't, touch Don't that. touch my steaks! I'm hoarding those, I'm... This is unfair, I'm, you're getting an unfair advantage. Uh. So one of these, fresh, one month and one year? Yep. Okay. Huh. All right. Hold on. All right. And you're trying to guess the one year frozen steak. Oh, now you're putting them back. I don't want okay. Red to know what I did. Uh, okay, I've got to guess. Okay, hand over the one year. Three, two, one. It's got to be number two. Uh, it's either two or three. Three ended up just being a bad. I was sure it was three after I two after I tasted, it, but then I had three twice again, and I was like, "Hey, it's getting worse." Oh, I made a mess. The one year old. That? Filet mignon is in the middle. Okay, yeah. And uh, this one's good. This is a fresh one. Yeah, that's a fresh yeah. one. So Link, yeah. Link, uh, kind of correctly guessed the. Well, not kind of. Totally oh wait, correctly. no. Yeah, the I... one in front of Rhett is the one month old, and the one oh. on Link's side is the fresh one. The fresh so, one. So yeah, kind of. <laughs> the fresh one tasted by far the worst to me. Like I think it just might be a weird piece of meat. Like I don't know what it or, yeah I thought that one was the best and it might be that it was it's just a little maybe it's a little undercooked but but the the definitively Selene, this is this is bad at a certain point yeah it was good to just just feed it to your dogs I'm talking about us yeah but the one month old was my favorite was your, was that your favorite too? yeah 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 so one month old is getting into a sweet spot and we're going from steak to fresh fruit salad one month old frozen fruit salad and one year old frozen fruit, fruit salad. Fr fruit salad apparently fr is difficult to say. Fr fr fruit salad. And um, all of the one year old fruits came from individual team members. So Chappie, Jasmine, and Hot Dog on a Stick employee, Matt Carney, provided our one year old fruit. Okay. Oh, one. Is there anything on there? Mm -hmm. Uh. Uh, yeah. Two grapes. Two grapes, huh? Two shriveled up grapes. Oh. Uh. Like an old man taking a whiz in a park. Uh. 
The grunt? Or two <clears> grapes? <throat> two no. grapes, is that a? Two grapes. What I mean, is I, this? I don't understand how the euphemism Those works. are some shriveled up grapes, man. Two grapes. Oh, and in the last round, I don't, I don't know if we, we, we gave you enough descriptors about why that the one-year-old steak tasted bad. Um, help him out, right? Um, I, I can't, you're more at a steak, man. I just thought it tasted well, bad. again. It was an aftertaste thing. It, there's a little, it, it, there's oh, wow. a little differentiation because we're not, we're dealing with the same cut of meat, but we're not dealing with the exact same brand of meat, right? And so I actually thought that the, but the, the, that, the fresh one was just an outlier for me because I just didn't like that meat, but the, the difference between the one month and the one year. Dang it, I just got two more grapes. <laughs> The one year had like a blandness that felt like something had turned in it a little bit. It's the only way I can explain it. And the, and the one month old actually had like a sort of an aged flavor. Ooh. But like a good aged flavor. You know what I'm saying? Like it had a, it was really, it was the level of flavor. Well, that, that answers your question. Now for this one, this, this third one, mushy alert. Ugh. Oh my God. Oh. Well, okay. I think this a, might be alcoholic. Is that a peach? I don't know why I keep going back in. Oh. Okay, well. I don't, I don't wanna go back in. I don't know exactly, I mean. I mean, that's horrible. I have a guess. <laughs> that is, that's scary. So it, it, that has to be okay. it, right? This is worth two points. Put your hand over the one year frozen. Three, two, one. It's gotta be this one. Yeah. And this is your fresh, yeah, right? Yeah, take your blindfolds oh, off. Oh, what did you do to us? Yeah. Ooh, that I was I mean, a, obviously this is the easiest one to tell. That the a banana. The fresh one's in now, the middle. Here, I will say. Bananas and strawberries. What happened to the year old was beginning to happen to the month old. Like, there, but it was kind of yeah, nice. Was, I thought that was bad. I thought that was no, bad it, but until this. It had like an acidity to it, which was almost <laughs> getting to like a... I don't know. Like I say, it's like heading towards alcohol. It's, but this is too far. This has gone too far. Good gracious, Carney. <laughs> Carney, you dirty dog. Okay, guys, it's the chicken breast round. Again, there's a one month old, a fresh, and a frozen for one year. Frozen for one year oh, chicken. Okay. Oh. Hmm, okay. Oh, sorry, I forgot the most important part. The one year frozen uh, version came from Matt Carney again. What is, Carney. what is he doing? What's he preparing for? He's got a well. He he, he was preparing for that baby that came. Oh uh, yeah, he's feeding got, that baby old got food. A, got a newborn baby. Yeah. He's at home with his baby today, and um, feeding us instead with all the crap that is not suitable for a child. Yeah, you can't feed that baby old chicken. Okay. Man. They really can't even have chicken for a while. It's gotta be at least a week old. <laughs> he was saving it all this time. Now that now that he's procreated, he's. Giving up all his chicken. Um, ne neither one of these are, are stellar. They're not great. They're not great. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Oh. Okay. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> oh. No. oh. You in trouble? <laughs> Tell how you feel about that one. One of them is ugh. It just keeps getting nastier, and I hope that's as nasty as it gets. Hmm. Once you kind of get that old taste in your mouth. Okay. You keep thinking you're tasting it. Yeah. Um. Oh, sorry. Okay. Putting these back. Okay. Oh. All right. <laughs> Three, two, one. That second one. Yeah. Is so nasty tasting. I'm not 100% yeah. sure we're right though. Yeah. We have to. You're, be. You're, no, you're both right. Yeah. Okay. That's the that's the one you're frozen. The one in front of Rhett is the fresh the one. The fresh one. And then in front of Link is the month old. Yeah, I couldn't tell if I was tasting resistance. This, was, this is pretty. Th no, I thought this was this was getting to be like this, but I was smelling. It really makes a difference. You can smell the oldness coming off of this one, yeah. and it was influencing even the first bite of this chicken. The us duh needs to get a memo that like things don't last forever. Well, they're just worried about safety, not like taste. You know, eating all this food just reminds me about the mythical kitchen. <laughs> oh, when yeah. I think about the mythical kitchen, you know what I think? They're they, not just having fun over there. They're they're teaching things. They're, there's information. They're, they know better than this. Yes, I mean, Josh, in one of Josh's latest videos, he's talking about how he makes his meal prep interesting for those of you who are prepping your meals. Oh, nice. There's no bland year-old chicken breast for Josh. Uh-uh, wouldn't be caught dead with it. Mythical kitchen channel. 
Okay, for this last round, we've got strawberry cheesecake. But before we dive in, I have to mention that our oldest cheesecake comes from uh, a member of our resident Freezer Boy Kevin's family. You would think that Freezer Boy would be Matt Carney, but I'm giving the title to Kevin because if you remember, Kevin previously gifted us his grandma's three-year-old frozen nut roll that he tried with Duff Goldman. Do you want to tell my grandma, Lee, that it's the best nut roll you've ever had? I'll have to taste it. Lee, I'm going to have to taste it first. Smells kind of like a thrift store to me. (laughs) It's amazing that it tastes exactly like it smells. (laughs) Like an old baseball card. Well, I'm sorry, Lee. (laughs) It was not good. Memories. Uh Uh-uh. Okay. So is this, is this a year or, or three years? We got a fresh, a month, and a year, and I'm I'm keeping the identity of Kevin's family member secret, uh, and I I've been told to reveal it only if you like the cheesecake. How much do I? What, are you using your finger? I'm trying to get just get a. I think I got a lot. Oh, that's a lot. Well, I got a little. I don't know what would happen to cheesecake after time. My Recollection. You know what? I'm having a recollection. Hmm. Early on in my marriage, Christy's parents' neighbor would make all these cheesecakes, and then she would always give them to us. Like, I'm famous for my cheesecakes, and we'd get them and we would freeze them and forget about them (laughs) and never eat it because then we'd be afraid to eat it years later. I'm afraid to eat it too because I'm getting such big bites. Usually, you don't get huge bites when you just. And my bites are so little. Okay, so far so good. I got a lot of crust on that one. <laughs> nothing. You you came back with nothing? I still have a lot on my fork if you want it. Are you using are you using your finger? To, I don't want you to be touching the cheese. No, but I have a whole lot on my fork. Nothing. You want <laughs> My fork's coming in. No, I my horse coming in real slow. I, I got some now. I, what? No, he's oh. on the links on the third one already. Oh, it's funny because if you look at the close-ups and you don't realize that somebody's blindfolded who's cutting pieces, it's just like chaos. It's oh. just like, why would you ever do that? Mm-hmm. Okay, this is I, now I see why you're having trouble because reaching is makes yeah. it really difficult. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> All right, I'm coming back in because I still got nothing over here. You might get what my my fork offage. Oh, but what are you doing? I just stabbed myself in the gums. Mm. None of these are horrible. Okay. 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 Reminder: This is worth four points. Oh, yeah, any man's game. So this is yeah, this is it. Hmm. You ready? I mean, it comes down to. T- Two of them, it's hard to say though, dang. Okay. This Is this okay. difficult for you, right? Uh, nope, but I, but I mean, I have a very strong guess. I don't know if I'm right though. Yeah, I'm, okay. Hand over the one year frozen strawberry cheesecake in three, two, one. Whoop. Oh, you think it's over here? Um, wait, before you take off your blindfolds, stretch over to, I can't tell Link what your, I'm on the middle one. You're on the middle one. Okay, go ahead and take off your blindfold. Stretch over. Okay, so I didn't get, I didn't get much it. of that one, but this, oh, this one, was, this this one, one looked, was great. This one looks the driest. The first one was excellent. I thought this one was well, good. Well, I gotta to- tell you, it was made by Kevin's mother-in-law, Carolyn. The first one? Yeah, that was the one-year-old, one-year-old frozen one oh. is right in front of you that you like oh, the best. Better with age. The middle one is the fresh one, and then the one in front of Link is a one month frozen cheesecake. So you both were incorrect for this round. Cheesecakes keep. Cheesecakes they really do. Get better, as a matter of fact. You know what? I'm gonna dig up that one from Christie's parents' neighbor that we've had for 40 years. <laughs> 40 years? Okay. I, I do guess, have good news. I guess we've been married uh, for like 20 years. Link, you, you are 22. now the frozen one. Oh yeah, you see, so you got. I am the frozen you, you got one. Six to five. All right. What? Oh, what do I get? I get a jacket. Mm-hmm. Okay. You can, you can take home all the yes. cheesecake you want. Oh, okay. What do you? What, what, I don't I'll have throw, to do I'll all the work. I'm the freaking frozen one. I'll put it on you. Oh yeah. Here. <laughs> Here. Put those on too. <laughs> I, I gotta say, I'm jealous. 
Thanks for subscribing and clicking that bell. You know what time it is. Hey, I'm Nick. I'm Melissa. And that's the Abominable Snowman. And it's time to spin the wheel of mythicality. And they were never seen again. <laughs> After sending in the video. Click the top link to watch us figure out which of our body parts can melt an ice cube the fastest. Oh gosh. In Good Mythical More. And to find out where the wheel of mythicality is going. Aren't they like the same thing? Well, but kinda, like but this I mean, is also this? This is but like, these are this not, is the not the same. Well no, but if you're strong enough, you can just like. 